YouTube, I'm going to do a quick update. Um, I have two new additions. This is obviously KC, so it's not one of them. But here's KC, my female hypo. Doing good. She shed about a week and a half ago, area. She ate, um, I want to say, 20 minutes ago. She's kind of scared and ready to bite, wanting more. But that's her. Really nice tail. One of my favorite bolas. Here is Saga, who's ready to bite me. The albino. He just ate too. Doing good. He has ate every week for me since I've gotten him, but he has not shed once. I've had him for two months area, I believe. But yeah, that's him. He's always wanting to bite me until I get him out, and then he realizes I'm not food. I'm going to try not to get bit. There we go. But yeah, he's growing, but he has not shed yet. Not quite sure why, but it's him. He's still got his pattern. Nice pinkish tail, orangish tail. Looking good. Yep, that's him. Gonna be moving him into a bigger tub soon, I believe. Um, it's Junior's cage. He just shed literally like about five minutes ago. Finished shedding. It's the turtle. I got rid of my iguana because I'm not, I, I don't know, I just wasn't really liking him too much. I mean, I'm a big snake guy or monitor guy, but iguana just wasn't for me. There's Junior. I have him in this cage because I'm about to feed him since he just came out of shed. It's looking kind of dark, but here, hang on a minute. Let me grab a light and you can see him. There he is. He's looking good. It's about as bright as he gets. Can't really tell very much. He smells the rats, and I tried picking him up before the video, and he almost got me. Um, I'll show you Kira the Motley real quick. And then I'll get on to my new additions. She's doing good. Grown. There she is. Let me grab her. Oh, don't bite me. You're okay. You're okay, little girl. Chill. Let me bring her over here. Don't mind the mess. But there's her. She's my most active boa. I take her out and she's everywhere. She's looking good. She has not shed for me yet either. She's ate every time. Great tail. I love her. So glad I got her. Come to say hi. Alright, let me set her back in her bin. That's my boas, or my original boas, not including my new one that I got. Um, over here, just let me grab the light so you can see, and this 10 gallon is one of my new additions. Let me take the lid off a second. Reptile bark, everything. Over under his little hide back here is something I never would have thought I'd get an Emperor Scorpion. Yeah. Never would have expected me to get one of those. But yep, that's him. Not too fond of being held. 
but I'll hopefully get a video together soon of me holding him. Oh, yeah, and here's Junior's skin that he just shed out. All the way up over there. And then on to my new addition, which I'm the most excited about. Let me put the camera down a second. There he is. He's a six foot red tail boa that was possibly crossed with Argentine. He's a big boy as you can see next to my hand. Friendly as can be. Glad I got him because one, I didn't pay for him. My friend got him for me for my birthday yesterday at the Reptile Show. And I'm also glad because I finally got a big boa back. I had two at one time, but I had to get rid of them because of personal reasons. But, uh, yeah. Finally glad I got one back. But he's going to eat, and so is Junior. So, yeah, um... That's just a quick update, and peace out, guys.